Hey guys, in this lesson I will be showing you how to install the Mirth Connect integration engine on a Windows PC. I will also show you how to open the application. So Mirth Connect is an open source integration engine and it's managed by NextGen Healthcare. So I will leave this direct link to the downloads page in the description below so you can have easy access to it. There's a Windows installer, Linux and Mac OS. Uh, we will be downloading the newest version, which is the 4.2 currently. You don't need to download the administrator launcher separately. It's included in this installation package. So I'm going to get the 64-bit installer. So now with the installer downloaded, we can open the installer. And let's click on yes. And let's go through the installer by clicking next. You can read through the license agreement and accept the license. You can determine the installation folder. I'll just go with the default. Now we can select which components we want to install. Now we do want all of the components. So let's, we need the administrator launcher. The server manager is handy also and the Merv Connect server that's mandatory. So. Let's go ahead and install everything. And let's click on next. If you don't have anything else uh, special running on the computer, the default ports 8080 and 8443 are fine. And let's click on allow access. We can set the password policy settings here, but let's leave those as default. And also let's leave the path paths as default and then click install service. Okay, now with the download completed, we can say run Merge Connect Server Manager. I don't want to view the readme file, so I'll untick that and click on finish. And now in the taskbar, we see the Merge Connect Server Manager is running. And now the next thing is to install the Merge Connect Administrator Launcher. Let's click on next. Again, the license agreement. And let's use the default folder. And let's do the installation. And with the installation completed, we can click on Run Merth Connect Administrator Launcher by uh, pressing Finish. Okay, it seems the default address, which it's suggesting this is from a previous installation I had earlier, so this is wouldn't be correct for my environment. Uh, I'll, I'll just close this up and let's see if it brings up the correct settings when we go to the Merth Connect Manager and here we say Launch Administrator. So that gave us a web start link. Let's see, can we double click that to start the administrator? Okay, now it's saying localhost 8080. I assume this will work. Okay, now we have the login screen and the default password is admin and the default username is admin. Let's click on login. And now we are in the Merv Connect administrator and it's asking us to set some of the default settings here. It's asking us to, to change the password and uh, I'll just fill in admin again here and, and hit finish. And now the installation is, is completed and we have access to, to all of the tools here, dashboard, channels, uh, and so on. Here we could go ahead and start importing channels or creating new channels, but that's not in the scope of this video. I will do some future videos, so check the links at the end for new videos. If you found this video helpful, please give the video a thumbs up and let me know down below in the comments was the, were the audio levels better this time. Thanks for watching.